Hello Retroburn here and in this guide I'm going to show you how to have a Steam game library split across different hard drives. As a side note, I'll also show you how to move Steam games to another drive's different folders. So I recently bought a 1TB hard drive for the sole purpose of accommodating Steam games folders and my ever expanding my documents folder. The problem is, I didn't want to transfer my entire Steam library folder to the newly bought HDD as that would defeat the purpose of moving games in the way I wanted to. I want to, split, I want to split my Steam game folders across different drives, not transfer my entire Steam install directory. So I googled for how to have Steam game folders on another drive and I found a Tom's Hardware forum thread about the topic. The best answer was given by a dude named USAF Retired, and on the webpage, he delineated this. So let's follow that. Okay, once that's set up, we choose a game from our library and install it in the newly created Steam folder. Let's choose 8-Bit Boy. Once the installation process finishes, we'll let it run and see if the system does recognize the Steam folder. And yeah, it does work. The procedure can be, needless to say, used in moving Steam games to other drives. So this is how you set up multiple Steam apps download folders across multiple drives. This has been Retroburn, and if you like this video guys, please like and or subscribe. It would go a long way in supporting my efforts to produce more videos for you, my fellow PC gamers. Stay cool, stay frosty. Bonus tip. In the course of my googling, I learned that you can transfer Steam games to different folders. Let's do that for the newly installed game. So let's move what we just installed to another Steam folder. Our default one. So yeah, like before, once the transfer process finishes, we'll let it run and see if the system does recognize the Steam game folder. success. You can of course still do this for your other previously installed games in your old Steam library folder. You can move them to a newly created folder in a different drive. And that's it.